kwamba matarajio yetu yalikuwa ni kudumisha uhusiano huu wa kirafiki katika kupitia e, tanzia ya ya elim kati ya wanafunzi wa hapa Tanzania na wanafunzi wa USA na bahati nzuri tumefika kule na kwa kweli tukawa na project mbalimbali mbali za kitaaluma na ambazo e, zime tu pelekea pengine sisi kubaini tofauti mbalimbali katika masuala mtambuka ya kielimu lakini vile vile imekuwa ni nafasi kubwa kati ya wanafunzi ambao wamewakilisha wanafunzi wengine kutoka shule ya Whitehall High School kuweza kujifunza katika e, masuala mbalimbali katika project za masomo katika upande wa engineering katika masuala ya uchumi katika masuala ya, ya social studies na pengine kikubwa nafikiri ambacho sisi tumebaini kwamba mfumo wetu wa hapa wa elimu Tanzania tunajikita sana katika kuzungumzia au kufundisha nadharia lakini wenzetu tumekuta ambao wako levo sawa katika e, shule za kule ambao wao wanasema ni mfumo wa high school kama hapa tunavyosema high school wale wanajifunza zaidi katika maarifa ya vitendo e, kwa hiyo tukagundua ni shule za high school lakini wao wameenda tu mbele wanakuwa na technical course ambazo mwanafunzi kama yeye anataluma au anatajiliba ya, ya, ya kuwa engineer na anza mapema tu kama anatajiliba ya kuwa mwandishi wa habari wanafanya exercise kabisa pale na anaenda e, in air e, wanafanya drama za namna hiyo kama ni anataraji baada ya kuwa daktari mwanafunzi huyo huyo katika sekondari kule e, anavifaa kabisa ana practice kama kufanya sajale na mambo ya namna hiyo sasa kitu hicho kikawa kimewabeba wanafunzi wa huku na kwa masika E, kuona kwamba bado katika levo zile zile tunazoita kwamba ni mfumo wa hapa na mfumo wa kule USA kwa kweli kuna utofauti mkubwa lakini ambacho wale wameamasika wame sana ile shule ya Centennial High School uh, USA imeamasika sana na wanafunzi hapa wa Tanzania na kwa kweli wameahidi kwamba wao wataendeleza ulafiki huu ulafiki huu ndani ya nchi ya Tanzania ambao tayari umetengenezwa na shule ya White Lake High School na ni jambo ambalo hatukutarajia lakini baadaye ya kwa masika na shule hile ni ya serikali shule hile St. New ni shule ya serikali miongoni mwa shule za jimbo la Georgia e, ni shule ya tatu katika ukubwa ambazo serikali inaweka mkono mkubwa serikali ya, ya, ya Marekani baada ya kupokea ugeni huu wa wanafunzi kutoka White Lake High School ilibidi wanafunzi hawa kutoka Tanzania wawapeleke viongozi wa serikali kukutana na balozi aliyekuwa wa hapa Tanzania ambaye anaitwa Andrew Young na ukisema Andrew Young ni balozi maarufu ambaye ana foundation nyingi tu ambaye amepigania uhuru wa nchi mbalimbali akisaidiana mbali, na Nyerere hapa kwa heshima ya kuheshimu wanafunzi kutoka Tanzania ambao ni wanafunzi wa White Lake High School ilibidi waambatane na viongozi wengine na principal wa chuo na kwenda kukutana na na na, na balozi huyo lakini haikuishia hapo tu ilibidi wanafunzi hawa wa Tanzania kwa heshima ya Tanzania sasa e, kutokana na nchi walivyosema inavyo e, katika kaida ya sasa hivi inavyokwenda katika habari za kidemokrasia habari za uchumi na kupinga mikinzamo ya lushwa walisema ikabidi wanafunzi hawa wape heshima e, kuwapeleka vile vile kwa governor ambaye ni mea sasa hivi anastaafu mwezi wa kumi wa jimbo la Atlanta anaitwa Isaacson E, kwa hiyo ni, ni heshima ambayo e, wanafunzi hawa kwa niaba ya shule nyingine Tanzania au kwa niaba ya Tanzania tumepewa kukutana na balozi huyo Andrew Young e, kukutana vile vile na governor lakini lengo wakawa nasema na kule kwamba ni kutokana na hali halisi ya nchi ya Tanzania katika safu za kidemokrasia katika safu za kupinga e, kupiga vita lushwa na ambao wanasema wao nchi kama bado imeendelea wanapotamani kutukokota sisi katika elimu wanapotamani kutukokota sisi katika kiuchumi awaoni kuna zile 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 taflani ambazo zinaweza kapokonya lile fungu kwa hiyo wanafunzi hawa kwa kweli mimi ni seme tu 
wamejaribu kutuweka katika safu na ya kutangaza nchi vile vile na kuweza hata sisi kutuweka katika mazingira ambayo kidogo e, atukutayalaji. Kwa sasa tulifikiria tu tunaenda ni ulafiki wa kawaida exchange program ya wanafunzi wa Tanzania, wa Italy High School na USA lakini sasa tukajikuta tunaunganishwa hata kukutana viongozi mbalimbali wa serikali. Kwa hiyo ni jambo ambalo tunaona ni jambo mtambuka na wao wamesema kwamba wanafikiria kupitia program hii wataweza kuweka kimo hata cha taaluma ya wanafunzi hawa ikibidi waachane na, na, na mifumo hii tulionayo na wao wamewambia kwamba wanafikiri kuweka ishala tu ya ulafiki huu wanaweza kufanya kitu Tanzania e, ambacho sasa ni cha kuvuta na kuweka hamasa wanasema sasa hivi USA wao wamekuwa na swala mtambuka la kuamini katika student academic exchange program ambazo wanasema zitaweza ku extend teknolojia walizonazo e, na kupitia wanafunzi ambao wanafikiria ni taifa la kesho kwa habari hiyo tuna tunafarijika tuna sisi na tunawashukuru wa Tanzania kwa sababu safari hii ilikuwa ni ya shule ya White High School lakini bado ni safari ambayo kiangalia imekuwa ni msafara wa kuwakilisha nchi America imejifunza vitu vingi vitu kidarasani na watu wanaoishi mazingira ya America yenyewe ilivyo pangiwa utulivu wa mji ulivyo hasa vitu vingi sana nimejifunza kikemo na kikubwa zaidi ni nama wanavyojifunza darasani teknolojia wanavyoitumia na pamoja na jinsi watu wanavyo wanavyoishi yani mtu anavyomjali mtu mwenzi kitu kikubwa sana ambacho nimejifunza ni tofauti na jinsi tunavyo tunavyoishi sisi huko Tanzania Petro umetoka mbali sana mpaka kufikia hapo ulipofikia unawambia nini wengine ambao wanatamani kufika hapo ulipo wewe? Ah. Uh, Kwa kweli tu ni kwamba ukiamini kitu unaweza, ni hakika unaweza, lakini niwatie moyo kwamba hata kama unapitia changamoto zipi, ukiamini Mungu na na kumomba Mungu zaidi na kuweka juhudi zako binafsi, hakika jambo lolote lile linawezekana kwa sababu binafsi kwa hii tripu nimedhaminiwa kutokana na jitihada zangu ambazo nazionyesha darasani na zaidi nicho Naitwa Doreen Martin nimejifunza vitu vingi cha kwanza nimejifunza kwamba watu wakuwa wana ushirikiano alafu cha pili nimejifunza kwamba kule watu wanajua ku watu vizuri ni wakarimu wako friendly ndio umetembelea ndio tumetembelea aquarium tumetembelea aquarium same ya human rights tukapata nafasi ya kwenda kuongea na na governor wa huko ndio shule tumekwenda tumejifunza vitu vingi tumejifunza jinsi ya kuishi na watu jinsi ya kukaa na watu vizuri jinsi ya kuwasiliana na watu kwa lugha nzuri na mambo ya teknolojia katika safari ya America nimejifunza vitu vingi kwanza kwenye kwenye taaluma masomo manake ndio nimejifunza vitu vingi sana sana kwa sababu huku Tanzania tunasoma sana vitu vingi theoretical si, lakini kule wanasoma practical kama kama kitu sawa nafanya kwa practical yani ndio hivyo nimejifunza sana e, maeneo tulia tumea tumeona vizuri kama tulienda eneo Georgia Aquarium huko tuliona vitu vingi kama kitu kilichonifurahisha sana ni kuona dolphin wako pale dolphin wanaambiwa wana, wana, wana na watu wanasemeshwa na watu wanafanya vitu kama anaambiwa nenda pale anaenda anaambiwa salimia watu ananyoosha mkia hivyo anasalimia ni furahi sana nimejifunza yeah. vitu vingi ya kwanza darasani ya kwanza darasani kuna mengine ni kasi ya juu kama bayoji mimea jinsi wana transfer foods kutoka mimea nyingine nimejifunza najua sasa hivi na nimejifunza maisha kule jinsi ya kukaa vizuri maisha kule jinsi ya kukaa vizuri kuishi na watu kwa upendo nimejifunza
na marafiki pia nimewapata na marafiki pia nimewapata Okay my name is Esther and vitu ni hivyo vyana kwa viko very impressive it's like they are very different things which differs from Tanzania and the outside country first they are very civilized very understandable and they know how to treat a person properly and they they do perform their things according to time they do follow time more than anything and we learn different things when we went Centennial High School on how they learn the way they are the way they do perform their things how do teachers teach in in which kind of manners how how are students being treated like and they don't normally use sticks at all they just like stop doing this and they do perform it it's different from Tanzania it's like a Tanzania student believe that some they do believe that a, stand, a Tanzania student cannot be able to understand without giving some sticks to him or her so we learn different things we see large buildings made of different things we learn something from museums and other things so it was kind of pretty fun we really enjoy it and we learn something it's just let me i don't know how to say it i'm <laughs> i can just say it like when they go there or if they wish i wish they could get a chance to go there they learn a lot first they learn how to live with people on how to react some they learn from stop being stranger like like when they something oh this is kind of awkward no they should learn how to live with people and those people they hate like whispering while they sit together they hate whispering so it's just kind of, you learn some kind of manner that oh this guy hates whispering so whispering while people are sitting together it's not good so you get to know something and they don't like like when people are sitting in the dining you start chatting listen to me. no they don't like it they like when it's full time we all be together there is for dinner supper whatever we share we have fun you do your things accordingly so yeah that's